Hi, my name is Tracy Velash, and I am a youth health educator for West Virginia University in the Family Nutrition Program. In my work, I see children every day struggling with being overweight and obese. I'm talking about 2-12 to 12 year olds being overweight. The reason for my social marketing campaign, Buy Bright to Eat Right, stems from my passion for helping make West Virginia healthier so our kids can be healthier forever. Obesity is an epidemic in America. West Virginia has the second highest obesity rate in the nation. The CDC reported in 2015 that almost 69% of West Virginia adults are overweight or obese. West Virginia is also ranked number one in diabetes, heart disease, and hypertension, all related to obesity. More than one third of adolescents are overweight or obese in West Virginia. That's one in three children. Children and adolescents who are obese are more likely to be obese as an adult and are therefore more at risk for adult health problems at a young age. Here's the great news. Obesity is preventable. Consuming vegetables can reduce the risk of becoming obese and developing related diseases. According to the current USDA dietary guidelines, healthy eating is one of the most powerful tools to reducing the onset of disease. The guidelines recommend consuming a variety of vegetables to stay healthy. Vegetables are high in vitamins, minerals, fiber, and other essential nutrients. Vitamins are complex substances that our bodies need to function. Minerals help our bodies function and they also make up many of our body cells as well as our bones, teeth, and nails. Although children are my main focus at work, parents are the gatekeepers to the food in the home. Therefore, I am targeting parents in this campaign. Geographically speaking, I have selected West Virginia for a number of reasons. First being that I work for WVU and West Virginians are our target audience, and second because the need is so high. I have specifically targeted low-income families. The reason for this is twofold. First, the grant funding, the promotion requires it. Secondly, low-income families are two times more likely to obese and have obesity-related diseases. This is typically due to limited resources and access to healthy food items. Buy Bright is targeting the counties in West Virginia with the lowest household income first. According to the 2012 U.S. Census data, the average household income is $41,000. First, we are targeting the counties that are 10% below the state average. There are 22 counties that meet this guide. It is also important to note that the average household income in the United States is over 53000 and in West Virginia, we have an average income almost $12,000 lower than the national average. Therefore, West Virginia as a whole has an income 22% lower than the national average. For this reason, if the campaign is successful the, in the original 22 counties, we hope to expand the campaign to include all 55 counties in West Virginia. Our behavior objective is to increase the consumption of bright vegetables. This behavior will increase nutrient consumption and have positive health impacts. The audience's willingness to purchase vegetables is usually dependent on affordability and the fear of tasting new foods. We want low-income parents in West Virginia to know that purchasing bright vegetables, those that are red, green, and orange in color, can decrease their family's risk of obesity-related diseases and be affordable. Our positioning statement is behavior-focused positioning. According to Kotler, in these cases, making sure target audiences know the specifics of the desired behavior is key to successful outcomes. The specific desired behavior is to purchase more bright vegetables. When people participate in the Bribe Bite campaign, the core product they are receiving is an opportunity for improved health. The actual product is our weekly in-store promotions. A new bright vegetable will be featured each month in the store. 
This actual product is the service of guidance, guiding customers towards the more affordable products and informing them of the benefits. The augmented pro product's purpose is to provide encouragement and further support. In the Buy Bright campaign, these products are recipe cards, nutrition fact information, and coupons. The audience may be more moved to purchase if they have these supporting materials. Buy Bright's purpose is to pr improve health by eating more vegetables. What better place to market vegetables than being at the point of decision making, in the grocery store, right in the produce section. Kroger and Walmart stores are located in each of the targeted counties. Using a larger chain can help the campaign with consistency across the stores. The coupons and additional promotions, such as tastings, would be made available during the busiest shopping times. According to the Time Use Institute, Saturdays between 8 in the morning and 2 in the afternoon are the busiest shopping times at a grocery store. Associated services are available at local West Virginia University Extension offices and at nutrition classes offered in all counties in some form. In West Virginia, educators offer free cooking classes and health education courses. ChooseMyPlate.gov also provides additional information, games, and tips for consuming vegetables. We want to highlight the benefits of eating vegetables and debunk the it's too expensive myth while making the audience aware of the extra resources available through WVU Extension and ChooseMyPlate.gov. The messengers of the campaign will be the participating grocery stores. They will be the main partner delivering the message through weekly signage at the seasonal vegetables. WVU Extension Service, Family Nutrition Program, and the Youth Health Educators would be the sponsors and main supporters of the content and tastings. The logos are incorporated into the signage, which adds credibility and a professional style to the campaign. Buy Bright to Eat Right is short and easy to remember and also uses rhyming words as suggested in the text. Retail displays and signage in the produce department will highlight the seasonable, bright vegetables on sale. Communication timing is going to be key to this promotion. If we are promoting out-of-season vegetables that are higher in price, we will discourage our audience, thus making it harder for us to reach our goals of improving health. Seasonal vegetables available in West Virginia will be highlighted each month in low-income grocery stores to help steer parents towards the affordable, healthy options. For example, April is asparagus month. In conclusion, the Buy Bright campaign has the potential to help improve the obesity rate in West Virginia. Numerous studies prove that a better diet improves overall health which in turn will reduce obesity-related diseases. Obesity is an epidemic. Children are no longer suffering from measles, mumps, and rubella. It's overeating processed foods with empty calories and the lack of physical activity. Type 2 diabetes, heart disease, kidney failure, cancer are all likely to strike people at younger and younger ages. We could very well be the first generation of parents to outlive our children. This campaign strives to highlight the foods that are good for the body that don't break the bank. It is our hope that the Buy Bright campaign will overcome this myth and help improve the health of low-income West Virginians.